Christopher Columbus High School is owned and operated by the Maris Brothers of the schools. All at Columbus look to emulate its founder, St. Marcin Champagne's spirituality. Maris spirituality is one of humility, prayer, simplicity, and love. St. Marcin based his spirituality on Mary, often referring to her in familial terms, such as Mary, our good mother. Mary is the perfect model of how Maris should act on their own road to the cross. With Mary as our mother, Maris look to help their brothers and sisters stay on the path of salvation. At Columbus, there are many examples of students and faculty helping others move closer to the cross. Maris identity in Columbus, most likely the best example of that is probably going to be uh, after school. Uh, the fact that there's a sense of real community. A lot of the kids here don't like to go home, not because there's anything bad there, but there's always something going on here. Um, well, I'm reminded of an anecdote a teacher shared with me once, that uh, when you buy fries at lunch at Columbus, you don't buy fries for yourself, you buy it for everybody. And the idea of community, the idea of sharing, um, you know, the cafeteria is a perfect place to see that happen. I see the Marist identity in Columbus every day when I walk on campus. Uh, you see a strong sense of community, you see the brothers walking around, and it's just a very strong uh, brotherhood of students. Uh, the students show it every day when we uh, participate in mass, when we go to youth group meetings every Wednesday. Uh, the students also represent the Marist identity by choosing to come to this school because we are a Marist school. Faith-filled disciples, Marist students come to possess a strong sense of God and a personal relationship with Jesus, Mary, and St. Marcelin, fostered through religious formation, a sacramental life, and prayer. I think we're constantly asking the questions that what makes you Marist, um, and that question um, is asked over and over again to young people, um, and I think that that question is really essential into them building their own Marist identities. Um, their answers are widely different, and um, all have different aspects of what it means to be Marist in their own lives. Empowered witnesses, Marist students, recognizing Mary as their model and companion, become joyful witnesses to God's love in their lives, enabling them to seek Christ in others, to live simply, morally and with integrity, respecting all of life and creation. Agents of justice and service. Marist students grow in their understanding of Catholic social teaching and stand in compassionate solidarity with the least favored. Well, I joined the Big Brother program, which I help freshmen or students in academic study hall who are struggling. So I want to show my gifts to others and help them who aren't as blessed as I am, but are blessed with other things. And you know, last year I was a freshman, so I, I could have used someone helping me there. So and if I were in their shoes, and I would want someone helping me. So I, I feel like I should help them, because that's what I would want. Spirit-filled members of family and community, Marist students embody a spirit which celebrates and welcomes all. I think the thing that stands out to me the most is the following example of, a, of our saintly founder, Marcel and Champagne, the fact that uh, a caring manner in our school. Teachers care very much about the students. The students are always willing to help other students, the fact that uh, it's a real family spirit and that's what our founder wanted the Maris brothers and all our schools to exhibit, a family spirit, getting along with one another, caring for one another and I think one of the greatest things that I see with our faculty and so forth is their presence among students after school seeing them at games, seeing them at practices, helping them after school if they have problems in, uh, with a particular subject and so forth. It's just a very caring environment and that is what I think is the most important thing. Well, it's been my experience that if you're a Columbus a student, that's all that's necessary. Uh, it doesn't matter where you're from, your economic background, your ethnicity, etc. If you're an explorer, you're an explorer. And I think if you look in the cafeteria, you, you see uh, gentlemen eating 
football players eating with um, uh, debate team members and uh, the freshmen, if there is a freshman in an upperclassman lunch, uh, can sit down and uh, feel just as comfortable where maybe in other places they might be more intimidated. After 53 years of excellence, Columbus continues to promote Marist spirituality. It is prevalent among the teachers, administration, staff, alumni, and students. Columbus looks to the future in hopes of continuing this spirituality for years to come.